Pisces, Pisces, hello, <laughs> hey Pisces, it is April, May and June, it is the second quarter of the year 2020, Pisces, let's go and see what is happening, I see you men on top, you men is standing up in this period, so let's see what's coming up for you, Pisces, Pisces sun, moon and rising sign, Go and listen to the general um, messages, Pisces. All right, Pisces, your own energy in the in the month of April. You're in limbo. So Pisces, you're standing in limbo. You're in limbo. You're trying to figure out a situation. So you're going within. You're very quiet. I like this um, energy for you. It is best month for you guys. God, Pisces, what is happening? You're the first one that bring up the energy of the devil. So in the month of May, you're dealing with a deceptive um deceptive situations so um be focused be focused is a fire energy and it's just the energy from the ego and negative people but in june the wheel of fortune so pisces i love this for you i so love this for you all right pisces be careful in may there is some negative forces oh pisces so um, this um, quarter is going to be a very successful quarter, if, especially if you're in business. Absolutely success is coming up for you, Pisces, especially if you're a business or salesperson. It is good. So water, fire and fire. But the Wheel of Fortune in the month of June is absolutely fabulous. I see money. June is looking good. Some of you could be traveling in June. However, that is happening. I'll see some of you traveling in a June, okay? So, however the situation is, I see you Pisces businessmen. June, you're going to be like eating the jackpot. If you're also um, not a business person, you're going to be eating the jackpot, okay? So, um, ooh, your Pisces, your water. I got to shit. I got to gotta clear your energies from the fire side, okay? Pisces, there is a little fox, okay? We're going to be seeing where this fox, this fox is landing. And this is why you're taking some time um, to look within because you're dealing with uh, the fox. The energy of the fox is like someone at your work and you, you got to be careful of this person at work. Okay. So let's see what is coming out in April. It's as if uh, you're coming out of some hardship or you're trying to figure out how you should deal with someone on the workplace. That could be it that is coming in and that person is a Taurus. So some of you are dealing with a Taurus. I heard sign this person is a Taurus and um, this person is, is, is sly, is sly as a fox, but is a Taurus. Be careful. I see that this person is going to be offering you something is a Taurus. Be careful. Be very careful. I want you to stand up and have all eyes open, your intuition open in the month of May with an Aquarian or with a conflicts. Okay. And um, some of you could have a conflict with a Taurus. Be careful. Watch the Taurus very, very careful. And um, because I'm seeing that you're in the month of uh, May, you're going to be having some communication with someone who is a very deceptive okay all right and um some of you could have a conflict with a taurus virgo or a capricorn person all right um this is so uh, whatever is transpiring i see some of you are receiving like an offer of love from a taurus a young but this person is sly need on don't do it don't do it um ladies you're in the reverse with um the wheel of fortune and some conflicts with some money and that has to do um with hardship ladies you're on the investigation whatever is transpiring um you're on the investigation there's communication ladies there is no communication between you and your sister or a friend but it's coming up as a sister or a family member so be aware of what is transpiring ladies so i'm seeing some of you are um you know 
in some hardship because of some deceptive situation that has to do with an Aries and a Cancer. And uh, um, I see that a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn is offering you something, but you know, it's like you're thinking whether or not you want it. And uh, I see that if you take it, that is where your future lies. I see communication, okay? What is happening to you, Can um, Pisces? Your energy is supposed to be upright. What's happening? Um, whatever the hardship is, I see you're going to be coming out of this hardship. You're going to be um really overcoming a situation with a fire sign person. Now, whoever this fire sign person is, I see you're going to be come um overcoming because I see information is coming in about uh, um a fire sign person. Now, whoever this person is. Could be a Sagittarius and I see that they're trying to offer you something um, but you are over this person you're really over this person and I see you're keeping this person at arm's length because you're over this person whatever is transpiring between you and uh, Aries the or uh, Sagittarius person you're over this person you saw the lies and deceptiveness of this person and you are over this person whoever this person is you're realize that they were lying and deceiving you and they told you lies about a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn now you realize that this woman has done nothing you are finding out the truth about this woman okay I see um money is going to be coming in so um whoever has business money is going to be coming in and I see some of you um a fire sign person is only connected with you it could be a Sagittarius because they want money and I see you're seeing that that because of money this is the reason why they're connected to you and this is a Sagittarius a young Sagittarian person it could be your, your um no it, it's a young person so some of you men could be seeing a younger person but you realize that they are only connected to you because they want money okay I see some of you are turning your back on a relationship um, um, with a uh, Aquarians or a Libran. Um, so whatever is happening, it could be that you decided, okay, I've, I've had enough of this person. This person and this situation, so you're letting it go, okay? Um, I see that you are going to be overcoming some issue I see this is um, really you're overcoming some issues whatever is transpiring I'm loving this because I see um, you ladies are standing up and speaking up whatever is transpiring you're standing up and speaking up because you saw the truth of a, an Aquarian what Aquarian has done and you ladies are like no so so it didn't it didn't went like that this was the way that it went didn't went like that okay I see a new offer is coming in I see some of you could offer um, a new offer is coming in from a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn I see that this person is much older it could be a mother figure um, I'm not saying whether she's Taurus Virgo or Capricorn but I know that she is an elderly person or a mature person um, and I see she could be offering you some money however this is transpiring but I see it's an offer of money okay um, so she could be saying, you know, I send you your ticket. Why don't you come and visit me? Okay. Something like that. Like she's going to say, or, um, yeah, if it's your mother, your mom is going to say, you know, um, I, I, I get, I get your ticket. Why don't you, um, go and see, you know, whoever. So if you're married, um, to an Aquarian or you were in a relationship with an Aquarian and I see there is just someone else that you want to know how this um would have gone i see that you are definitely um your mom could be um giving you the money to go and see this person definitely i see help is going to be coming in money you're going to be making a lot of money help is going to be coming in and you're going to be making a lot of money and i see um this is going to be helping you to release you of something it's like some of you or in a relationship with some air sign people it's not good um, either they are controlling you with love magic because it's the energy of the devil now 
you gotta look at this and don't think I'm BSing you because I love you. I love you, Pisces. Okay, look, this is the devil, and these are the people that is around you, and these are the deceptiveness that is around you. So, um, it is up to you to find out and understand. Um, you could be bonded because I see they bond you to them, and and this is the reason. Now I see some of you, whatever that was going on for you, ladies. I see you're dealing with a legal issue and it's like a younger Aquarian want to throw you under the bus. So however you're going to come out of this Pisces woman, I see a younger Aquarian want to throw you under the bus. I see a balance that is going to be coming in. Um, a balance, an offer is going to be coming in. So you ladies, you could be receiving an offer from this legal issue. However, it explained an offer could be coming up. A lot of business is coming in for you, Pisces. Um, I see um, an, um, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, a young person. So some of you men could have been seeing um, a fire sign person. And I see this fire sign person um, is only in the relationship for money. And I think you know this and you're like, um, I, I, I want to move to someone different or it's as if you know a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn and you're thinking this person is so much more of a mature person and you want to end the relationship. Some of you, um, the, the Nine of Cups, which is your energy and the Angman, by going within, you're going to be finding out the right direction to make so some of you are going to go within to think in april should i end my relationship with a libran or an aquarian um you know what 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 should i do okay so i think you're gonna go in but you're not going to go with a fire sign person it's as if some of you have been seeing other people but one person, um, like this one person, you know, this one person just, when you're with this one person, you're like, they give you peace. They give you everything. It's like the world stop. I think you might be. Yeah. And this is a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. Okay. And I see if your mom is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, you're going to be, you know, letting your mom know about this. And um, if you need the money to go see this person, I see that your mom is going to, like, financially help you um, with uh, um, the money to go see this person. So, hold lot is happening. All right, let's see. So, I see the five of uh, pentacles. So... I see that you, some of you are in financial hardship. However, this is coming up, um, but it's going to get better. So if in April and you're in financial hardship because of a Sagittarian, okay, and the lies of this person. So some of you men were seeing a young um, fire sign person and you found out that this fire sign person was very deceptive. Um and you're like uh, um they have taken they were taken a lot from you i see you regret a situation with a cancer um you really regret ever connecting with a cancer ever communicating with a cancer you regret the situation all right now i see a situation that um, some of you are going to be offering a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn some money. Why? You're offering them some money. You saw the truth to a situation. You're offering them some money. Yeah. I see multiple opportunities. You ladies... Some doors of opportunities is going to be opening. Use these doors to walk through, okay? Whatever is transpiring with you ladies, you're in the reverse. Whatever is transpiring, you have gotten yourself in some messy situation. The rest of you are good. 
Mm, a lot of emotions for you, Pisces. And I see communication is coming at you. I see you want a new offer with someone, Pisces. Okay. But and there I said, um, Pisces men, um, you know, Pisces men, be careful of some uh, deceptiveness with some money. It's going to be, let's say you Pisces men have done some deceptiveness with some money. It's going to come out, but I see Pisces men, be careful in this month. Pisces businessmen, be careful in this month. Or someone could be trying to deceive you of some money. Be careful. Okay, so Pisces um, and the money. So what is this saying? Pisces men, someone could be trying to steal from you. I told you, I told you. It has something to do with you men, especially you men with a third party or uh, with two, three women, um, a fire sign woman. She, you're going to be finding out that she's lying anyway. Okay. You already know that she's lying. I don't, but she's going to try to deceive you of some money. Okay. But the truth is going to come out because the energy of the sun is your general energy for this month. I see some of you wants a new offer. Um, some of you Pisces wants a new offer from a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. I see a new, I, I am. Um, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn is offering you something, but I see some of you are like, no, I, I don't know. I don't want this. So, all right. Wow. OMG Pisces. Oh my God. All right. So Pisces, you're dealing with a fox and it's a fire sign person. So be aware. I got to put my glasses on Pisces. You are dealing with a fox, Pisces, and it's a fire sign person, okay? So you got to be aware. Um, you're dealing with a fox. Whoever this person is, very slow, 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 slow. You got to be aware, Pisces. Oh, my God, this person is so slow. Um this person the this is this is a sly person and it's not coming up as you guys but it's coming up as a young fire sign person so you gotta be aware but the most important thing is that we're not even this is either someone you're working with or someone you're seeing that is younger than you are this person is taking you for everything that you have okay this but it's like you you guys are aware and on top of the game and I see you men just looking at this person and just thinking really you know and it's it's like every time they have a money issue uh, and, and and you found out something about this person and it's as if you're like, I need to get rid of you. It's not a child. It's not a child. Some of you, it could be the, your child's mother. Okay. Some of you it could be your child's mother, but, um, the men is just popping up all over the place. And some of you men are seeing a younger fire sign person. And this person is popping you for every cent you have in the month of May. I see is I you're gonna be going in and, and thinking if you want to end a relationship um with um an Aquarius, Gemini, or Libra or a divorce. Okay. I see you regret a relationship with a water sign person. It's definitely with a water sign person. So you regret a relationship with a water sign person. But I, and and this 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 people are really, you know, the energy of a fox, all right, and the energy of a fox because this is coming up. A fox is an earth sign person. Yeah, um, the fox. Ooh, the fox is an earth sign person. Now check this out, Pisces. Smart, strong partner or mate, wise teacher. So there, I told you, you want to get rid of this person. It was someone you were seeing or you're married or you're in a relationship. The fox is an um, enchanted creature with 
plenty of uh, mystique to go around. <laughs> The fox personality are skillful in business and also make great teachers. <laughs> they are quick to learn and adaptable, well to known to situation. Fox are ideal life partners as they commit to relationship for a very long term and their mutual characteristics keep things excited. <laughs> A fox energy help us to stay true to those who are most dear to us. Okay, when the cards appear, reconnect to those you love. Okay, fox don't do well when they slip away. <laughs> okay, um. Pisces, Pisces. Now, this is intriguing, Pisces, because, all right, when you're um, in balance, you're magically, you're an ignatious teacher and um, mundane, okay? When out of balance, sneaky, unsure of their identity. <laughs> to bring into balance partnership and connection, okay? So, it's like you you Pisces okay but anyway this is a good um energy for you Pisces because um you like this you like the fox energy you like the excitement okay now Pisces and this is um um I've always tell you guys that you're very psychic and you're very close to the source of all things and um I can tell you all the people who have gotten um, the spirit energy. Now, Pisces, if you are aware of what you have, you are unbelievable. The Virgos, the Capricorn, and uh, Virgos, Capricorn, and Taurus have had similar energies. I think the Virgo had the black egg. Uh, or the Taurus have the black egg. Um, but Pisces, you eat the chart, and trust me, this is what you have. Do you know what this is? All right, I'm gonna try to see if I can get it and put it in there. You have the cosmic egg, completion, harmony, the infinity within the finity. The cosmic egg is the final card in the journey of the animal spirit egg and it represents the unfolding of the cosmic consciousness okay this state emerged after we have treated the part treaded the part for quite some time, and through self effect and grace we experience ourselves realizing a sense of contentment and oneness spontaneousness and arriving within us and the veils of our self limitation, brief or um, in sense, the cosmic elf has not activate. We may feel as if we will never get there or that we travel alone, disconnected from others, even if our contentment with this card is the belief, apparentness as a monetary glimpse of fresh of interconnection. It potentials of energy stay with us. The cosmic egg is a, a remedy for the um, fragmentation of modern life. It's throughout the powers of the card that we are all reminded of the cosmic contact written at the beginning. I do love this. I'm really going to put this up for you guys. You have the energy of uh, the... Um, cosmic egg and the energy of the crow this is an air sign so you have earth the cosmic egg this is super so whoever decided to come at you in a month of may bam 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 okay all right you don't have to worry then we have the energy of the crow and uh, trust me june you're gonna be rocking like rocking 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 in june so um don't worry about this 
Now, my other question, because I really um, wanted to see, but um, there is the extended read in Pisces. Um, go check it out. And I want to say namaste. Until next time. Thank you.